Hey, what's going on guys? Dr. Sean J. Harris here, Generational Wealth Academy. Great morning to everybody. Happy, I think today is Thursday, Saturday number five. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hey, listen, I wanna share with you a little bit about mindset and the way wealth mindset operates. So this morning, well, late last night, we got a, a text message into one of Caden's social media platforms. It's a show, an award show. They wanted to nominate Caden uh, for an award show, which we were grateful for. But uh, I filled it the call this morning and I spoke to the person that told me, hey, your son's been nominated uh, for this award. Um, they gave us a, a whole layout of different things, requirements that we had to do, which was just time consuming. As far as uh, you got to put a certain amount of posts on your website, 25% of the posts got to advertise their particular event. Uh, it's a voting process and we just don't have time for games like that. But here's the deal, they also stated that we had to pay $100 per seat for the nomination. That's not even saying that he was selected as the winner for a Chief of the Year award or whatever the award was. So the point that I'm saying is, I want you to understand how wealth mindset works. A lot of times people say, well, I just can't figure this out. I'm in my same financial struggle and I can't get out of it. Well, typically it's the way that you're thinking that's preventing you from excelling and elevate to that next level. Let me let me elaborate on that a little bit. So let's say, for example, if uh, Tara I, Kennedy and Kaden, and Tara Mom love to see him get awards. Uh, so let's say she went with us. That would be five hundred dollars uh, towards an event that we're not even sure he's going to even win uh, the category. So let's show you how the wealth mindset would utilize that five hundred dollars in a better and higher use. So again. Kennedy and Kaden awards are great and everything, but they don't strive and operate on getting a piece of plastic or a piece of wood as far as a plaque or a trophy. It's always cool to be acknowledged or whatever, but one thing about it is we don't pay to be acknowledged. You know, they still gonna do what they're gonna do. They're still gonna make the uh, the victories in life that they're gonna do. So let's, let's show you how we can change that $500 into a sit down dinner meal, a plastic trophy, and let's show you how to convert that over. So this is just five hundred dollars. Stick with me. This gonna this is gonna set somebody free. So with Kennedy's company for an example, Hurry and Kaden doing a major pitch competition tomorrow. I'm just gonna run past some numbers that Kennedy's gonna pitch in her event tomorrow to show you how to grow five hundred dollars. Watch this. I'm gonna show you right now how to grow five hundred dollars into seven figures. Here we go. Kennedy purchases with five hundred dollars. Kennedy can purchase. 400 bottles of either her vitamin or her uh, seasoning line. Okay, so and that's at a dollar and 25 cent per unit. So 400 bottles at ten dollars each is four thousand dollars profit. Four thousand dollars would then buy three thousand two hundred additional bottles. Three thousand two hundred bottles at ten dollars each is thirty two thousand dollars. $32,000 buys 25,600 more bottles. 25,600 bottles at $10 each is $256,000. $256,000 times $10 is, oh, that will buy um, 204,800 bottles. 204,800 bottles at $10 each is $2,000,000. $48,000. That is the mindset of wealth and what we do with money. So we can blow the $500, have a dinner, dress up, get a plastic trophy, and there's nothing else to show for it. Or we can use that same $500 and maneuver it, direct that money, deploy that capital where it can now grow exponentially over a short period of time. So with this, Kennedy's aim is to get a product in a major box store so just imagine if that $500 investment was channeled towards the launch of that product line in a Kroger, in a Publix, uh, in a Walmart, in a Target, and it got shelf space, and then she started moving that volume. That same $500 just converted to over almost $2.1 million. So again, understand the way we think as wealth creators, as wealth builders, as entrepreneurs. So hopefully that helped out to help move the needle for that person that was just like, you know, what? I just 
can't figure this thing out. Why am I staying stuck in this space? It's just the way we think, okay? So we change the way we think, we change the way our pockets look. All right, guys, I'm Dr. Sean J. Harris. Make impact and make money while you're doing it.